Welcome back one and all to Red Dead Redemption 2. I am the Dark Seraph. Last time we escaped the island, found the new camp, only for it to immediately be attacked by Pinkertons. I blame Bill. Is that fair to blame Bill? I'm gonna say yes. Oh good, I still got my weapons. Which means... I got my mouse, uh. I don't really like dual wielding. Good, I'm glad it doesn't just take away all your equipment. But we're gonna go see what the good professor... the third has for me in San Denis. Whoa, 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 who's this? Your face looks familiar. Ah, uh, maybe I was mistaken. Don't mind me. Bye. They're just out hunting. There's no need to bother them. <laughs> They're getting bored. His life may have been Can troubled, I just shoot him? But his passing is peaceful. Just kill him already. Somebody shoot me, please. Okay. Oh, skin up. You don't seem overly humane to me. I think it's mighty fine. <laughs> <laughs> well, they both died. <laughs> Professor Bell. Well, you won't need what's in your pockets anymore. I'm assuming you have my money. Electric chair blueprint. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yep, he had my money. Okay. Now, I'm going to go to the gunsmith. Come, blue car.
Come along, my dear Blucher. Look out! That was actually kind of funny. And a dark and twisted. Oh, this guy again. Help you. Help this guy again. Hey, mister. Hello, friend. Do you want to be rich? Sure, I'll take one. That'll be fifty dollars. Fifty dollars for a book? And cheap at the price. You read this and you'll want to give me a hundred more. Forget about it. Huh. Well, you're lost, buddy. You frickin' con. Hey, get on the horse. I only help the wise, for the foolish are beyond saving. Now let's see what they have new at the gunsmith. Ah, uh, that I have. Time for a new gun, perhaps? Yes, it is. Let's have a look in here. That's still considered locked. But I have one. Okay. That's still considered locked, but I have one. But I don't have one of those. That's considered that's still locked. What what's new? If it says new weapons available for purchase, what's new? Can I help you find something? Hmm. Very nice. So it's good to have some Gun oil on hand, I guess. Come on, Blucher. Move. Hello. Let's go help the French artist, dude. There's a few of these old horse head hitching posts in my town. Hello. They're still around if you can find them. Possible. <laughs> it's a free show, so don't come ask me. I just don't like how much time you're spending with the man, is all. Just wait until you see his work. It's very progressive. Well, I'm not so very sure how I feel about progression, paintings or otherwise. Come on. You won't have seen the like of it before. I promise. Maybe that's a good thing. Hold, hold on. Let me compose myself. Just because you slap progressive in front of it doesn't mean it's actually progressive. The party. Or good. I think that is That's great. different. Or could be Roman. There's the Man, snotty Frenchman. <laughs> oh, that's nasty. Look at these idiots. Excuse me, Mr. Chatonet. Couldn't you have painted some drawers on her? Madame, 
I paint her in her natural state, as she was and will be in paradise. There's nothing natural about that. Close our civilization, repression, death. To be naked is to be free, innocent, alive. Like Buddha said, you know, we are all just here to fuck. <laughs> well, that explains the decadence of those Hottentots. Hey, you got a picture of my wife here, in her delicate. <gasps> Henry, oh. is that your behind? Oh, why would you be shown it to that man? That's my mama. <gasps> as nude as the day she was born. Oh. Stop looking at my husband's buttocks. Mm -hmm. Stop looking at my mama. Well, maybe she shouldn't expose herself like that. This is disgusting. A nerve on you. That's it. Fight, 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 fight. You filthy little man. Oh, oh, come on, horse, we'll leave it. Hey, I'm coming after you, Frenchie. Hey. All right. Break it up, every one of you. Everyone needs to calm down. Someone's gotta have something good in here. Shut up, you snotty little Frenchman. I'm looting in here. These people got nothing. Fuck it. Take the hat though, it's a nice hat. This did not end well for you. This way, this way, come on. I think we are okay. The exhibition. What can you say? It was not boring! Uh, that it was not. Hard to test people. Push them. I thought I was a fraud. A no talent brush washer. Now I'm not sure. We provoke emotions, no? You keep provoking emotions like that. All your canvases left punch holes through. I told you I was a whole ass! <laughs> you did. And you are. Now, maybe go be an asshole somewhere else for a while. That was certainly something. Here we are. I know a lady over here. She may let me stay for a while. Good luck. That picture I gave you, it will be worth something someday. I can feel it. Perhaps. Right now, it seems like the only thing it'd get me is kicking the balls. Oh, you are funny, you know. I hope to see you again sometime. My angel, my little bird, it's me! <laughs> the French, everyone. Okay, now where? I guess Sadie at the saloon.
Mister, are you okay? Been better. Mister, are you okay? Are you okay, Mister? <laughs> mister, you, you don't look so good. Let's get you to a doctor. Just one second, sir. Come in, pal. Come in. <coughs> Mister, I need some help. And so it seems. <coughs> and that's Dr. Mister to you. I'm sorry. I was joking. Look, friend, I don't mean nothing, but you got money? I mean, before I start treating you, because I got a family. Yeah, I understand. Here, let do you. Uh, sure. Thank you. Now, what's wrong? I mean, what appear to be the symptoms? Well, I think you've heard them. I'm coughing. Uh, is there any blood? Sometimes. Uh -huh. Okay, now here. Breathe. Again. Let me see your tongue. Say ah. Uh. Ah. Uh. Sounds like pneumonia. What is it? It's not good news. Well, I guess that. You got tuberculosis. I'm really sorry for you, son. It's a hell of a thing. Oh, what do you mean? You're real sick. You. It's a progressive disease. You'll be. The best thing is rest. Getting somewhere warm and dry and taking it easy. Now, is that possible? Sure, I can just take my winters in my country club in California. No, it's not possible. Well, like I said, I, I'm real sorry. Yeah, well. Tuberculosis. Oh, wait, wait. Uh, let me That's get you a nasty little bit shit. more energy today. I don't have a lot of control of Arthur right now. Who made you the messiah to these lost souls? And you as good as killed him yourself.
I wonder if it wasn't that mountain or just all those light, subtle coughings he was having before finally caught up with him. There she comes. Icarus and friends. Any problems coming in? Nah. Guess they know now we ain't in the city. Who, Mr. Milton's friends? Yeah, they've had patrols out ever since you boys disappeared. Well, at least you're alive. For now, yeah. What happened in... Uh, Guama? Yeah. <coughs> Nothing nice. What happened to Dutch? He seems... I don't know. Seems as... What began happening in Blackwater began happening years ago, maybe. A slow decline, I guess. What do you mean? I ain't quite sure. What happened here? I started gathering people up as best I could after you boys left. And John, you know that part. I do. And Hosea? So that too. Oh, we got Lenny's body out as well. Arrived the morgue and buried them together. Follow me. It's weird how it said new weapons available, yet the weapons I've yet to un... Those weapons are still yet to unlock. So, what's your plan here? Unless that Conoco well, rifle is unlocked and I just anything, missed it. We need it. to make sure John's even still at this prison. And how do we do that? We need to get up high enough to get a proper look at the place. But it's on an island, ain't it? Unless you're planning on learning how to fly. That's exactly what we're going to do. I found us a hot air balloon. You ain't serious. Now, the pilot, or whatever you call him, he thinks we're just in it for a lesson. Bit of a tour. <laughs> He's quite the character. I think you'll like him. You know, I'm impressed. You really stepped things up, ain't you? Hey, we didn't know if you was even coming back. Whole thing hit folks real hard. You can see it. Heron's gone falling fully into the bottle. Strauss is a bag of nerves. Swanson, well, Swanson's actually gone and cleaned up his act. So I guess it ain't all gone to shit. I'm just happy you boys were able to find us. Javier said he got the letter I left at the post office. That was a good idea. Until the Pinkerton showed up. Oh, by the way, I've been hunting O'Driscoll boys. Killed two of the sons of bitches at a campsite last week. What? Nice. She a beauty, ain't she? From here on the ground, yes. Mr. Bullard? Hmm. Mr. Bullard. Ah, Mrs. Adler. It's good to see you. Good to see you. Ah, uh, this is my friend I told you about, Mr. Morgan. Ah, yes, Arturo Bullet. At your service, sir. At your okay. service. Okay. Morgan. Well, it's a nice, fresh day for flying, sir. A day like today, an Icarus would have made it across the sea. Ha ha ha. Have you ever flown before, sir? No. Oh, it's quite a thing. Quite a thing. Now, put these on and hop in. Well, ain't she coming? Ah. Well, women can't fly, sir. Are you insane? They can't. Oh, no, sir. It does terrible damage to them, to their vapors. I thought everyone knew about that. Why, a delicate flower like Mrs. Adler? <laughs> Heavens above or below. Ah. Where'd you find this guy? I told you you two would get on. 
Are you sure about this? Certain, sir. Quite certain. Mrs., let us away. Wish us luck. I've only crashed twice. Now, uh. on that <laughs> That's reassuring. And hope for the best. How did you get out of this? <laughs> okay, here goes nothing. Right, time to catch a few vapors of our own. It's a little overcast, but I'm expecting some good wind once we're high enough. We should still have some decent views over the river. Now, one hates to be coarse, but on the subject of ablutions, liquids over the side, solids, do your utmost to levy the situation until we land. Okay, Mr. Bullard. I had a client once who fell foul to a rotten oyster on the ascent. A decidedly harrowing experience for all involved. Keep going, sir. We need to get up above the clouds. It really is stunning up there. You'll have seen nothing like it. I'm sure. Westerly wind, so keep her around this height. This particular vessel is state of the art, sir. Imported from Europe. You won't find more than a couple of these on this side of the park. So long as it works. You sure you shouldn't be doing this? Oh, not at all. A child could operate this with a little supervision. Besides, Mrs. Adler told me you were very keen to learn the ropes. We have plenty of those. She did, did she? It's way the fucking gone over here. say I got off lighting. Look, I I'm trying to concentrate here. Maybe ease off the throttle there, sir. Ah, that's better. Look, we can see for miles now. Did you breakfast in the city this morning, Mr. Morgan? Not exactly. Well, I have a boiled egg in my pocket here that you're very welcome to. I think I'm all right, thank you. Recalling the ablutions uh, discussion. Well, just say the word. So, if I may ask, what got you interested in the pursuit of aviation? I didn't exactly. Mrs. Adler thought she'd surprise Ah, oh, a very nice woman. And no shrinking violet. Definitely not. I prefer slightly more feminine attire on a lady, but variety is the very spice of life, as they say. Or is it, though? Did you know they locked up the man who wrote that in the mental asylum? I did not, Mr. Bullard. Whoa, there. No need to go any higher. See that building up ahead on the island? That's the infamous Sisica Penitentiary. We shouldn't fly too near to it, though, sir. Sorry, we're going in for a closer look. What do you mean? Just that. We're going in for a closer look. Please, this is most irregular. Well, you want a happy customer, don't you? Look, this isn't funny, Nano. What on earth are you doing? The guy Flying! Is Calm down. They won't care if we stay high enough. I'm just looking for a friend of mine. A friend? Poor bastard has a habit of being in the wrong place at the wrong time. 
I heard they got him working the fields in a chain gang. Dear God. Unusual. Relax, Mr. Bullard. Take over. Keep us well away. I'll do my best. This filly isn't the easiest to control, you know. That ain't John. I can't believe we're doing this. Nope, not there. Looks yeah, like him. That's him. Ah, my God! What are you doing? They're shooting at us. I can see that. Ascent! Ascent! This is absolutely insane. Oh, my Lord. Oh, the wind speed is picking up. We should stay at this altitude, heading northwesterly, so that should take us back to land. Dear God, I'm shaking like a leaf! Alright, we're in the clear now, Mr. Bullard. You can get up. Good Lord! My heart Has is Has ever been shot at before? <gasps> Come on, man. I must say, the specifics of this job were not described to me at all sufficiently. <clears throat> well, it's done now. Mrs. Adler? We're being chased. Yes. Try and get us near. Will there be more trouble, sir? I expect so. Perhaps let's not use the shotgun. to mark targets. She's got Lemoyne Raiders after them. Okay, now let's try the shells.
Quickly now. You know, you could climb, you know. Okay, that's a wicker basket. How much cover did you think you were gonna get there? Well, they're not masculine anyway. Real men would protect and cherish women. Degenerates like these want to abuse them. Well, I've got a shotgun, so. Hope you didn't need those brains. What am I saying? Of course they don't need them. They're O'Driscolls. There are a lot of them, and I'm running out of shells here. Now I'm out of shells. Hey, what did I just say? Like Sadie. Come on, you little bitch. Where are you going? Left you 
an hour ago. You can't stay out of trouble for one goddamn hour. You got that poor bastard killed for his troubles. I kind of liked him. They got Comb, the government. They got Comb O'Driscoll. They're going to hang him in San Denis. Hang him? OK. Mm -mm. He's already been tried twice for murder and found guilty. Sure, no doubt he'll escape again. No, he won't, because we're going to make sure of it. I we have our own problems with the law, in case you ain't noticed. Dutch will want to see him swing. Sure, Dutch. He wouldn't even help us with Marston. And our situation is really messed up right now. You know how things is. Bastard's gonna swing. I'm gonna make sure of it. Closely followed by Marston. You saw him? Yes. Fields. Okay. Then we go rescue him. <coughs> From a state penitentiary? No. But from the fields? Yes. That we can manage. It's well guarded. Guarded, sure, but not behind bars. No, it's not behind bars. So, that's how we'll do it. Bust him from his work detail. I guess. It's best just the two of us go. <coughs> the two of us is all there is, anyhow. Good, because two is all we'll need. I'll get us a bunk. A little one, and we'll sneak in and get him out of there. Meet me at Copperhead Landing. Thank you, Arthur. Whatever you say, boss. I heard that. We have an herb here. Oregano! But seriously, I'm actually, I really like Sadie. She's insane, but I like her. <clears throat> well, I'm going to end this one here. Thank you all for watching. Join me next time on Red Dead Redemption 2 as I... Actually, I don't know what I'm going to do. Actually, I'll probably have to... I'm going to go work for Dutch. But I need to stock up on ammunition. I'll do that off camera and meet you back at the camp. But until then, I am the Dark Seraph, signing off.